I regret nothing. Hey, it's Team Rocket. Meow. What do you want? You can't pass through here right now. We're in the middle of guard duty and it's very important. What are you doing here, twerp? Shoo, go pester someone else. Okay, well, that's fine. Speaking of pester someone else, we got a delivery to give to Professor Oak, right? So let's go do that. Sorry, for some reason, all of a sudden, I had an urge to capture a Pidgey. I can't explain it, but I gotta go capture a Pidgey. Even though I don't need another one. Even though I already have, like, three. Hey, catching Pokemon levels me up. Welcome to Pallet Town. It's called Pallet Town because a artist's palette holds many different colours, and the rest of the game's towns are named after colours. I bet you didn't know that. Back to Professor Oak's lab. Now, in the old Pokemon games, you wouldn't get your Pokedex until after you deliver Professor Oak's custom Pokedick. So, what do you got? Why, Kasumi, back so soon? How is little Eevee doing? Hmm? Hmm. He loves me. Goodness me. Eevee here seems like it's really come to be a true partner to you, Kasumi. I think you've got what it takes to become a great Pokemon trainer. What's that? You have something for me? You handed the professor his parcel. Oh, so my order arrived. Thank you for bringing it to me. Hey, Professor Oak, it's about my Pikachu. Its moves are... Whoa, Kasumi, that's so cool. Eevee just rides on you like that? No, I just ride on Eevee like that. <sighs> oh, couldn't resist. Ah, and now we have Ass Face as well. What fine timing. I've just been delivered some very handy items, which I think I'll share with the two of you. You got some Raz... Seriously, that's what you ordered? Boring. You put the raspberries in your catching pocket. Great, I've been starving. I'll stop you right there, son. These berries are for the Pokemon to eat, not you. If you eat it, you will die. When you want to catch a Pokemon, try throwing one of those at your target before you take a Pokeball in hand. You'll find the wild Pokemon will be so happy to have a berry to nibble on that they'll become much easier for you to catch. That was close. I nearly swallowed one of them up right myself. <laughs> now then, you two. It's up to you to decide if you want to catch lots of different Pokemon or simply focus on training up your favorites. My only request is that you have fun either way. Well, that's fucked. I'm not going to have fun playing this garbage. Well, I hope you get the chance to meet many different Pokemon. As for me, I want to catch tons of different Pokemon and train them up to be strong. Wait up. Oh, I see. So the order is different, but it's the same story beats, so to speak. Your first rival battle would be after you got your Pokemon before you get your Pokedex. But now, after getting your Pokedex and delivering Oak's parcel, we have to fight with a rival. That's interesting. It's a little bit of a wicker 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 remix. Battle time. Alright. Battle time. Battle time. Battle time. You are challenged by Pokemon trainer Assface. Look at that face. If ever there was an ass face, it's a real bit of society right there. Pokemon trainer ass face sent out Pikachu. Go waifu. <laughs> Fight. I have four moves. Delete an older move to make room for quick attack. Waifu used quick attack. <laughs> You're definitely meant to win this one, aren't you? Bang. The opposing Pikachu fainted. I fucking wrecked your Pikachu, son. Grew to level 9. What? Did I lose? I picked the wrong Pokémon. Got 120 pokey yen for winning. Ah, oh, jeez. 
There I went mouthing off like I knew everything, but then I lost. How embarrassing. I probably should have trained my Pokemon up a bit before trying to battle like that, huh? Let's battle again sometime. Smell you later. Did you enjoy your first taste of battle, young Kasumi? Your partner Eevee seemed to like it. Battle against many trainers and help your Pokemon grow strong. And the way my head is pointing, it looks like I'm trying to kiss your Eevee. And keep catching more and more Pokemon while you're at it, too. But then again, I would kiss my Eevee as well. Well, let's see if Team Rocket have moved. Oh, hello. Hey, Kasumi. Oh, look at Eevee. You two are already looking like great partners. I've got the perfect little gift for such a great team. You got sportswear from your friend's big sister. Oh, so that's Daisy. So you put the sportswear in your clothing truck. Try putting that on Eevee. You can go on an adventure in matching clothes. Waifu looks very happy. You can pet Waifu by putting your hand on it and moving your head. Oh. Sort of making the hair spiky, isn't it? Boing. Boing, boing, boing. Play with waifu whenever you want. Oh yes, I'll play with waifu. <laughs> Can, can I switch my clothing down to underwear? No, of course not. It's not one of those kinds of games. Oh, hello, Pokemart man. Pokemart is a convenient chain selling all sorts of items, so please come visit us. Sample. Because money and time is what we don't have. Because ample time is what we don't have. Trainer's eyes have met. I'll battle you with my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> you are challenged by Youngster Ronnie. Youngster Ronnie sent out Rattata. Oh, so cute. My Eevee is best Eevee. I'm gonna fuck your shit up, mate. Oh, look at that. Wasted. Get riggedy riggedy wrecked, son. Your party in waiting also got experience points. Of course they did. You're really strong. You got 60 Poke Yen for winning and Pokeballs. It's my rival. The arrival of my rival has made this town very rively. Ah, you look pretty pleased about something, Kasumi. Oh, did you beat another trainer? Good job. You little shit. Well, since we're on the topic, the Pokemon you sent into battle might have lost some HP or PP, so you should take them to a Pokemon Center and get them healed up. I should go to the Pokemon Center and get my PP healed up by Nurse Choi. Got it. It doesn't cost any money and doesn't take long at all either. Just remember, heal up after battles. Why are you being helpful? You're meant to be an asshole. And then, like, the Pokemon Director is like, Actually, no, it was never intended for the rival to be an asshole, you know, like, uh, the the rivals should be friendly and help you. It's just, no, no, you don't understand. They're meant to be an asshole. We're meant to hate them. He says it doesn't take any time at all. Look at that. It took fucking forever. In Pokemon Crystal Clear, it's instantaneous. Nintendo, you should try to be more like Crystal Clear. Oh, Team Rocket have gone. Wow, your Pokemon is riding you. <laughs> no, I'm riding it. That's super cute, but I think my Pokemon would be a bit too heavy for me. That's why I have it walk with me instead. You can check your party in the main menu and choose a Pokemon to take out of its Pokeball, and it will walk around with you. 
Hey, I didn't want you to do that. Why, why did you, why did you do that to me, huh? You just automatically assumed that I wanted one following me. That is awful. Fuck off. This Pokemon gym is always closed. I wonder who the gym leader is. Giovanni, head of Team Rocket. This tree looks like it could be chopped down. I wonder if it still has an item in the other side. Like in the olden days. Yes. It does, but it's just a potion. Hmm. Well, at least they're remembering where all the things are hidden, so... I'll be able to pick up all the rare candies and shit that are hidden around here that I remember where they are, if they're still in the same place. Onwards to Viridian City. Oh, wait, no, we're there. Onwards to Pewter City and meet my friends along the way. Come on, let's go. Excellent throw. But do I really need another bell sprout? The answer is no. All right, you caught a bell sprout. There'll be some cool stuff to collect in Viridian Forest, though. Yes, they grew. They grew and grew and grew. And they kept growing. Hey, well. If your Pokemon uses a move that's the same type of as type... Yeah, I knew that. You are challenged by Bugcatcher Brian. But catcher Brian sent out Weedle. Uh You weed all over me. Is that a is that a Pikachu? Is that is that a Pikachu? It's a Pikachu. Pikachu. The wild Pikachu make Pikachu sounds. Pikachu. Pikachu. Peek at you. I will peek at you. Excellent. There's no way in hell this won't catch it. Yeah. I caught a Pikachu. I am oddly enjoying this game in a way that I didn't think I would. I don't like the catching mechanic, it's still a load of bullshit. And I'm sure the game will do a few things to piss me off as it continues, but right now, I am genuinely enjoying this a bit more than I expected I would yeah there we go best of both worlds is that a wild tiny Pikachu it's tiny it's a tiny Pikachu I only took a tiny Pikachu trust me it wasn't a huge Pikachu it was just a tiny Pikachu. So I should only get a tiny sentence. You encountered a wild Kakuna. Kakuna. You know what? I've had some bullshit in Pokemon Go where it's like the Metapod ran away or the Magikarp fled. What did it do? Hop away. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's a Kakuna. It's it's not a fucking Jolteon. Chuck! Hey, do you have a big Pikachu? I'll take a big Pikachu, my dear. I'll take a big Pikachu anytime. You are challenged by last Joanna. Well, Joanna. Joanna, spend some time together, just you and me. Joanna, I'm gonna wreck this person's shit as well. Dead. You beat last Joanna. Oh yeah, I beat her all right. I beat her to within an inch of her life. And she enjoyed it. It's a tiny Kakuna. There's no way it can flee. Fuck's sake. You were so close to catching it too. But the arbitrary dice roll said no. 
Like, you could just throw the Pokeball and, like, instantaneously just tell me yes or no. Like, the fancy little animations are a waste of time because I know that you're rolling a number and you're checking if it's within a certain range and that is whether or not it gets caught, right? So you could just, you know, don't bother me with the with the silly animations. Yeah, you have Pokemon, right? Come on, let's battle them. You're challenged by bug catcher Rick. Uh, Morty, I, I got a, I got a Caterpie, Morty. I got a Caterpie, Morty. And I'm gonna wreck your Caterpie shit too. Fucking dead. Uh, Caterpie can't hack it. I got three Pokeballs. And this game is Pokeballs. Pokeball shit. Hello. Hey, do you know if Bulbasaur appear in this forest? Oh, I hope so, now you've said it. You're challenged by Last Brittany. Oh, Brittany. You did it to me, baby, one more time. You make me stronger than yesterday. And I must confess that my loneliness is killing me now. Opposing Nidoran is defeated. Eevee wins. Fatality. Could you listen to what I have to say, please? I heard from a friend they saw Bulbasaur around here. It wasn't registered to their Pokedex, though. I wonder if it was true. Like, at this point, it makes more sense just to catch the evolutions than it does to actually evolve them. What? I'm throwing straight. I know I am throwing in a straight line. What is this nonsense? Pikachu learned battling with Chuck. Metapod's data will be added to the Pokedex. Hardens its shell to protect itself. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Pinky? Narf, Harden sounds like an erection joke. <laughs> I'm glad we're on the same page, Pinky. Yo, you can't punk out on a battle if you're a real Pokemon trainer. Bugcatcher Duck sent out Kahuna, the P Kahuna. Go, waifu! Quick smack with my quick attack. A critical hit, the opposing Kakuna fainted. Riggedy rickety wrecked, son. Waifu got 17 EXP points for winning. Pidgey grew to level 11. Pidgey wants to learn quick attack. Why does Pidgey have four moves already? You are challenged by Last Jocelyn. You know, I remember when the trick to catching a Pokeball used to be you'd press A on Use Pokeball. What? Dead. Everything so far has been dead in like one move. Pretty much. Throw a Pokeball to hit the center, you know, the center of the two ring. You're telling me stuff I already know. I am an accomplished Pokemon Go player with over 9,000 hours. Hey, wait up. What's the hurry? Why the rush? I'm not rushing. Are you rushing? I'm not rushing. You are challenged by Bugcatcher Sammy. But catch a Sammy sent out Metapod. Yeah, Waifu, you can do it. I am so certain you can do it. Like, in one hit. The opposing Metapod is dead. Yeah, don't mourn your Pokemon in Pokemon Tower, kid. You beat Bugcatcher Sammy. I give. You're good at this. I don't think anybody will have difficulty being good at this particular Pokemon game, seeing as it pretty much holds your hand the whole time. I'm already so strong, I reckon I'm gonna smash, like, Brock's gym. Many Pokemon live in only in forests and caves. You need to be persistent and look everywhere to get different species. Be persistent. Are you telling me that there is a Bulbasaur in that fucking forest? Because I'm going back. Eh? I'm scared. I'm not going back. Ah, uh, yes. 
Route 2. For 10 seconds. Pewter City. Hey, nice. I was hoping we'd run into each other, said Assface, looking smiley. You know there's a Pokemon gym up this way, right, Kasumi? You could battle against the gym leader there, and he's seriously strong. If you want to get stronger, you're definitely going to try to take him on. Okay, yeah, cool. Uh, geez, waifu, you ready for a good battle too, huh? Who wouldn't be? All right, you're making me want to cheer you guys on too, so take these! You got five potions from Assface. I, I bought some for you with the prize money I've been earning in all my battles. Beat that gym leader, Kasumi! And you can really call yourself a true trainer. Give it your best. Yeah, you're fucking. I will. I will give it my best. But for now, let's save our progress on our amazing journey. We have seen 13 Pokemon. We have 2,564 Pokebucks. And we've been playing for a grand total of one hour. Progress saved. I'll see you guys on the next Escape Route show with more Let's Go Eevee. Until next time, if we live that long. That's right, my Pokemon are all rock types, like my penis. Wahaha! <laughs> You're going to challenge me even knowing that you'll lose to my penis? That's what a trainer's honor demands, my penis. So be it. Show me your best and I'll show you my penis.